Hey guys and here's wishing you a very happy new year. On today's Foodie Friday, let's talk about something we hear very often and that is called lactose intolerance. You might see that some people consume dairy products and they're sitting in the bathroom for hours. Well, that is because they cannot digest a sugar called lactose which is present in milk. Now, it also happens when their small intestine is unable to produce an enzyme called lactase which is what digests the lactose. Now, this is uncommon in children and babies but it starts to show up in adulthood. Some common symptoms are nausea, diarrhea, constipation, gas, bloating and acidity and even sometimes acne. So the first thing to keep in mind is to obviously limit foods that contain a high amount of lactose in it like milk, cheese, paneer. So you can switch to vegan options like almond milk, soy milk, coconut milk, you can also go for tofu instead. Have smaller portions at a time. So with milk you can have 100 ml and paneer and cheese just two to three pieces. As the smaller portions that you have, the less likely it is to cause any stomach issues. Switch to non-dairy calcium sources such as green leafy vegetables like spinach, methi or broccoli. You also have sources like ragi, sesame seeds and nachni which are very high in calcium and do not contain lactose in it. Also, um, make sure that you're getting enough vitamin D so that the calcium is absorbed by the body. One can use over-the-counter lactase enzyme tablets or drops. It can help to digest dairy products. But it is very important that you consult a doctor or a nutritionist before using them. So there you have it. This was a little bit about lactose intolerance. If you do face any symptoms, it is recommended to consult a nutritionist. See you next time.